Axiona is a global organisation. Uh, we specialise in the provision of sustainable infrastructure and renewable en energy solutions. Uh, we've been here in Australia since 2002 and globally we're headquartered in Spain uh, with a workforce of over 38,000 people. We look at the construction and development of renewable energy projects from wind farms and solar farms. And then from an infrastructure side of things, we look at the uh, sustainable infrastructure projects, be it from uh, the provision of roads, tunnels, bridges and freeways. We always work on the principle that we build, own and operate our plants for 25 years. So we want to be in those communities and part of those communities for long term. We want to educate the community and take them along the journey with us. Uh, we want to address issues that are, arise throughout that journey. Um, you know, we've got a project called Warbra, which has been operating now for 10 years, and, and you know, that's been a great outcome, outcome for Actiana and the community. Part of the, um, the relationships that we build and, and the way that we work from a local perspective is also partnering with organisations from a um, technology, from an educational standpoint because we value and we see the importance of education and we want to be able to help the leaders of tomorrow become aware of the technology that's available to them and the importance of the renewable energy sector, um, obviously particularly from an Australian perspective. Renewables are important for everyday Australians uh, for a number of reasons. I guess the cheapest megawatt hour of generation that can be built in Australia at the moment is either wind or solar. So if we're talking about replacing our ageing coal fleet, the, the cheapest option is for us to replace it with wind or solar. Then you take a step forward and look at the environmental uh, impacts. Whether you believe in global warming or climate change or not, um, I think we all have to take a stand on making a better future for our children. And there's a real risk that if we don't get this right, that it, it could cause huge problems for our future generations. So our relationship with Deakin University um, goes back quite a long way. So Deakin and Axiona are working across a number of partnerships, be it from um, drone technology that are helping us look at um, wind turbine maintenance, um, virtual reality technology, looking at helping communities and stakeholders understand what uh, wind farms actually look like and experience it from a virtual perspective. Um, and then also looking at Two, from a, I suppose technology and innovation side of things, the World Solar Challenge is something that we're also working on as well. So it's a raft of projects that we've partnered together with, but it all comes back to you know education and innovation from an industry perspective. I think it's very important that Axiona participates in activities like this that we're doing with Deakin in the World Solar Challenge because as an industry, we have to put our money where our mouth is and we have to prove that there are sustainable ways to approach absolutely everything in life. And having a vehicle like this, be it the World Solar Challenge, is a a fantastic educational tool for students, for community members, for staff members, for the industry at large to see what can happen when you put innovation and renewable energy and technology together.